so guys today i'm finally taking out unboxing my 14 inch or 6.4 quart cast iron wok from lodge they sent me this and i was really excited when i saw what they sent because i wanted a wok for quite some time and it came just in time these cast iron um equipment that lodge sells they come pre-season all you have to do is wash it with soap and water and dry it promptly and then you're rubbing it with cook with cooking oil so what i'm going to do is do that and then we'll head outside and we're gonna be cooking up some chow mein today we're gonna be doing some lo mein, some vegetable lo mein. so to the hot wok we're gonna go in with some ginger and some garlic so i'm just going to allow this to saute about a 60 seconds a minute don't let it burn next goes my vegetables and we're just gonna toss and now you'd want your heat to be on a high because you want to saute this, these vegetables really quickly I'm really liking this walk it's really huge. It's something that you can stir fry in, you can fry chicken in. It's very versatile. So I really like that. To the vegetables, I'm going to go in with some Chinese seasoning or Chinese seasoning salt. You can use whatever brand you like. Okay, next goes in my noodles that are already boiled to al dente. To this, I'm going to go in with some vegetarian stir fry sauce. If you wanted to, you can use oyster sauce, plum sauce, hoisin sauce, whatever you want to flavor your noodles with. I'm going in with some seasoned soy sauce from Cheap Brand Products. And I'm going to go in with some Chinese salt or Chinese powder. This one is from Chief, but it's a Guyanese powder. And some JGM Chinese seasoning. I just want to toss. And to finish, I'm just gonna finish with some fresh scallions, which we call siphon trinidad. Mix that in and then your noodles is ready. So I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick demo using this cast iron wok from Lodge. I will link it in the description box down below if you guys wanna check it out. When you cook in this and you cook outside, it tastes so different and so much more flavor, all that smokiness gets into the food. So if you guys want to see a complete video on this recipe, I will link it as an end card, so be sure to check that out. So thank you all so much for joining me on this quick review of this cast iron wok. I love it and I can't wait to create some more dishes with it.